Hi everyone, I just wanted to come on and wish everyone a happy new year. I hope everyone's wishes and goals and dreams for this year come true. Stay positive, go after it. It's up to you. Remember, if you want to reach those goals, it is up to you to help yourself get to where you want to be. With that being said, I just wanted to come on and kind of give you my vision for 2024. I'm sorry I just came out of the gym, but this is me on a daily basis. I definitely want to continue to hit the gym more consistently. And I think on top of that, I want to be, I want my eating habits to be better because it's kind of pointless in the sense if I come here to the gym and kill myself for an hour, hour and a half. And then I go home and I just eat like crap and I don't see any results. And then I get discouraged and I don't wanna, it's not that I don't wanna go to the gym, but I just don't wanna follow up a diet then and because I don't see results. So I think that's something that I definitely wanna change this year. And I want to, I mean, I know that I have to do it slowly um, because I love food. I am Hispanic and our I just feel like the food, the rice, the meat, the desserts, everything is just uh, so <laughs> delicious and wonderful. And I just don't want to limit myself, but I also need to understand and do it at moderations. So I think that's something that I want to work for this year, this 2024, is that is definitely be consistent at the gym at least five days a week. Um, also improve my eating habits. I don't want to restrict myself from anything. I just want to do it in moderations. That's definitely because um, I would love to lose like 10 pounds this year. Um, second, I, you know, put God first. I definitely want to continue to go to church and have my faith get stronger and stronger I think I let it slip by me for a little bit and right now I have found a church where I enjoy going and I feel comfortable going I'm still loosing I'm still learning I'm still adapting to this new church and my son loves it I my mom comes with me my brother and his family they started going to that church, um, I think like a year or two ago, and I finally decided to go a couple months ago, and I've been trying to go as often as I can. Secondly, there's going to be big changes, hopefully career-wise, with possibly me getting a new job and being more local. So with that, hopefully this YouTube, I can pick up at least my goal for this year is at least one video a week if i can do two that's great i would love to do definitely continue to do what i do is shop with me i would love to show you guys organization in my apartment because my apartment is an apartment it's not a house so i have to work with um small spaces and how i do it and how we function as a family so i would love to kind of bring that into effect if i can um i've tried a couple i just don't like how i look i think in camera like when it comes to like full body um i'm more comfortable obviously behind the scenes and not being shown but i think that's something that i need to work on and you know love myself and know that i'm working towards to look better and to feel better so definitely, definitely one video a week. That's my goal for 2024. If I can do two, that's an extra bonus that I am putting myself on. Um, another goal that I would like to have is to reach by February. Hopefully we can have like 800 more subscribers within a month, like a month and a half. I would love to hit. 2,000 subscribers by February. My birthday's in February, February, and I would love to do a huge giveaway. I am going to announce 
uh, the new, new, new winner for the Halloween Gingerbread House. I've announced both winners and no, they have not reached out to me. So today I'm going to pick a new winner and send them a message and hopefully I hear something back. I've had that Halloween gingerbread house for months now. And now that we finally hit our goal of a thousand, I definitely want to give it away. Um, but yeah, 2000, I'm hoping and praying for February and my ultimate goal for 2024 is 4,000 subscribers by the end of the year. And if I can have more, that's, you know, God willing, I can have more, but that's, my goal for this year and if i can reach that that is amazing and um i would be ecstatic just to hit those goals um besides that just making sure that obviously i have a better relationship with my son i am a single mom and i just want to make sure that he knows that he is loved that we all care for him and i think he knows that but i definitely want to do more things with him not necessarily go do expensive things with him but even just going to the park and walking and just having those conversations because he is in third grade and he is getting older and I know sooner or later he's not going to want to talk to me and I know that's going to come I think it's it happens to everyone and I just want to make sure that he knows that I love him and that he is my world and that he can come to me whenever he needs anything. So I definitely just want to make sure that our relationship continues to grow. And not even grow, but become stronger. Um, financially, I would like to be at a place where I can pay off the little debt that I have. That would be my goal. Because I would love to start looking for houses this year. Even if I don't buy a house this year, I would at least... I want to put myself in the position where I could look for a house, if that makes sense. So definitely, I, that's my goal. And if I can get this new job that hopefully is in line, that I'm in line to get, it would be more of a steady paycheck. And I would still be in the military. That's something that I don't want to give up. I am, my civilian job is an elementary school teacher, but unfortunately here in Delaware, I just... I don't want to go back just in the sense of I love teaching. I love the kids. Don't get me wrong. That is something that I feel like I am pretty not. I don't want to say great or good. I think I'm decent and I think I I give it my all. I I am a huge advocate for the kids. I go above and beyond just the regular curriculum. I try to make it fun and I try to make it exciting. And especially when it comes to math, because that is my jam. I, You should see me in the classroom. I dance. I tra do transformations. I do all that. But at the end of the day, teachers are just not getting paid enough money. And unfortunately, I want, as a single mom, I just, I don't, I don't know how single moms do it as a teacher. I can barely... You know, I'm, I'm, we have warm, we have hot food every day. I don't want to rant. Like we have a house. I mean, we don't, we have an apartment. We have beds that we could, we sleep. So we're definitely doing, I think, better than some people. But I want, you know, just a, I don't, I don't need a mansion. I just want a house. I want something where my son can call his own and a backyard where he can run. And I just, you know, that's all I want. Just to live. I've always told everyone my dream in life is to live a boring life where I go to work, I come back, I cook dinner, you know, we talk, we do bedtime routines, and we go to bed and we do it again. And on the weekends, we do the sports and we just, you know, clean or we go out, see something, just live a simple, boring life. That is is my dream where there is no drama there's no issues we just we're just happy so that I am working towards that this year and I think that is the ultimate goal I want to make sure that I I think this year with these organization videos I want to go through everything I want to deep clean 
the little things I can't spend hours and hours cleaning every day because I I will start you know this full-time job and I just don't have the time to do that but I think if we can focus 20-30 minutes a day to deep clean just a drawer or a cabinet or you know go through everything and see if we need it if we don't if we don't donate it you know give it away see if someone needs it I think that would be helpful I want to a make more space for things that maybe I would buy in the future so I can have room and b I just if I don't need it I want to give it to someone who may need it so that's my goal stick with me thank you so 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 much to everyone that has subscribed has commented has shared has liked has done just help me get to where I'm at on this YouTube platform this is something that is new to me that I'm still getting accustomed to I'm learning how to edit I'm learning how to you know go and try not to shake so much and try not to talk or you know it's just those little things where I'm the kind of person where I wear my emotions on my sleeve and if I'm happy you can tell that I'm happy if I'm sad you can tell I'm sad and when I'm out shopping I get excited and I'm like it's just so much so I just wanted to thank every single person out there that has supported me that has done that I just has been nothing but wonderful sweet nice showed their support I just thank you from the bottom of my heart I am gonna try to my goal is one video a week so hopefully you guys can you know keep me in line to do that I don't know what day yet um but as long as it's one you know once a week I'll be happy and if I can do two that's definitely a bonus please don't forget to like share and subscribe stick with me tell me your goals leave them in your comment I'll keep you accountable let's keep each other accountable for 2024 this has to be our year to shine and to be seen let's do it let's go big remember it is up to us to change to get where we want to be and how one of my good friends there's power in consistency if we do it every day it becomes a habit and then that habit is a good habit and we can get to, we can get to where we want to be so stay safe enjoy this 2024 with your family friends loved ones just enjoy it all embrace it let's do it right let's let go of things that are holding us back and let's start fresh let's start new and let's do things how we want them to be so with that thank you so much and i can't wait for this new year and what's to bring us with new decor with new shopping with just everything so definitely thank you so much from the bottom of my heart i can't wait to continue shopping and show you guys what's out there bye